Hello everyone. We are Team Inferno, the official mass over team of Delhi Technological University. We are a group of 50 dedicated students all working together to push the boundaries of space exploration. Our team is organized into five specialized departments: science, mechanical, electrical, software and corporate. This ensures a holistic approach to designing, building and managing a rover. And now I'd like you all to meet our latest iteration, our own. Our Mars rover is equipped with a highly capable 6 degree of freedom arm that can lift loads up to 10 kilograms. The arm's modular design allows for easy replacement of the gripper with scooper for collecting tasks such as soil collection. This year we have integrated a risk differential mechanism which enhances the dexterity of the arm allowing for more complex and precise maneuvers. To aid in navigation and manipulation we have developed a camera based user friendly graphical user interface or GUI. The GUI allows the user to view real time sensory data and it just the camera feed sizes at any moment. This flexibility is critical for maintaining precise movements during complex tasks. Our rover features custom engineered 3D printed TPU95 frames with honeycomb structure and optimized inflow for durability and efficiency, enabling precise traversal over rugged terrain. The laser-cut aluminium 6063 Dega Hydrant chassis is lightweight yet strong, with a dual-axis rocket body suspension for high ground clearance and stability. The rover runs on four 11.1 volt and one 22.2 volt LiPo battery for extended power. A 2.4 gigahertz ubiquity antenna provides low latency. 1 km range communication while the base station's rocket m2 linked septa antenna ensures strong connectivity for mission safety a chassis mounted kill switch offers immediate shutdown in emergencies a rover is engineered to navigate diverse and challenging terrains autonomously it employs sophisticated techniques like sensor fusion obstacle detection path planning and slam these technologies work together to build real time map of its surrounding enabling the rover to safely explore even in unmapped area a 2d rp lidar scans the environment to detect obstacles while a microsoft kinect v2 generates a 3d point cloud helping the rover model complex terrain with high detail for global positioning the rover uses a ublox neo m810 gps providing latitude longitude and altitude data to refine its location further especially in gps limited areas amcl a probabilistic localization technique that integrates lidar odometry and imu data for sub meter accuracy is used An IMU, the BNO055, tracks the rover's orientation and acceleration, aiding in maintaining stability and accurate motion control. The Science and Research Department of Team Inferno tackles a very critical question: Is there life on Mars? Our Rohan is equipped with a highly advanced scientific module designed to carry out various calorimetric chemical analysis, supported by surface and environmental sensors, and a robust, precisely engineered in-house made scientific sim. Samples for the tests are collected by a scooping mechanism controlled by the rover's robotic arm. This year we are utilizing the potassium permanganate test for carbon, barium chloride test for sulfates and ammonium oxalate test for calcium detection. We have also employed MOS type gas sensors and surface sensors to analyze environmental data from our test site, delivering graphical results through Python socket programming. In addition, we have incorporated a soil and rock database which we have used to train a machine learning model which is capable of classifying soil into various types enhancing our capability to make prediction about its nature. This year we are also introducing a custom built Raman spectrometer capable of detecting ions and molecules in soil samples. This year we have implemented scrum methodology for effective project management. We have divided each of our major goals into smaller more achievable tasks which are then divided into sub departments. Weekly team meetings are held to review progress and to strengthen interdepartmental collaborations. Our funding comes from a balanced mix: 60% from the contracts, 30% from sponsorships, and 10% from member contributions, ensuring we have the resources needed to thrive. We have also organized and participated in numerous events and outreach activities, including open houses, inter-college collaborations, and seminars aimed at inspiring the next generation of space enthusiasts and future explorers. Team Inferno is back, stronger than ever, and ready to conquer IRC 2025. See you all there.